Yo, I'm Loser Chase. Welcome back to my playthrough of Dishonored 2. Please like and subscribe. You can also click the bell to get notified when I post new videos. I also live stream on Twitch. The link is in the description down below. Thank you for the support. Let's do this. Jindosh, it's time to pay for what you've done, and maybe I can find Sokolov. Audio. Welcome to my home, stranger. The door is always open to those with the will to pass the threshold. If you're here by appointment, then proceed and bide your time. Otherwise, I'd be remiss if I didn't inform you about the defensive mechanisms employed here, which are quite formidable. Many have entered without invitation, for reasons as myriad as the fish in the ocean. But of those who've dared to explore further, very few have found their way back out. Okay, so he's kind of issuing a challenge to us to sneak into his house. Clockwork soldiers sold at auction. Okay, I guess we'll just uh, step right on uh, through. This is cool. you I worked out who you are not a hired cutthroat your clothes are too fine an aristocratic thrill seeker that's closer you trained with weapons formerly but you're not a salon fencer there's a good back alley in your movements all that and you have your father's eyes your imperial majesty Welcome, Lady Emily Caldwin. Impressive, Jindosh. Then you must also know why I'm here. I'd assume my involvement with the Duke brought you to my door. Yep. Or maybe you're after washed up Anton Sokolov, comfortably residing in the assessment chamber. Either way, come find me and take whatever it is you seek. But if you fall, I'll have your body carried to my lab for dissection and study. Until either comes to pass, your secret is safe with me. I'll see you soon, Jindosh. Until then. Clockwork soldiers, there's an interloper in my home. Before you stands an invention that will endure the outside of experiencing the Jindosh clockwork soldiers. <laughs> Metallic skeleton and razor sharp. I hate to hear animation. Protective 
Okay, that's not good. Uh. Back for unambiguous enemy. Ow. Let's see here. Ow, I need a okay. Somehow I got out of that alive. Yeah, okay. Uh so hmm. Note here, whenever they explode, run away from them because they do damage. Gotcha. Understood. Assessment chamber's down there. I want to take out this guy really badly. At this point, the clockwork is scouting. Combat protocol. Ow. Enemy at rear playback. Space behind the walls. is this there's another choice here assuming jindosh's electroshock machine works I'm not sure i'd call it mercy the lila copper spoon clockwork nice. army timetable going to destroy this man. Air 
Aramis Stilton. Conditioning Sokolov. Sokolov is more resistant to the notion of calibrating than anticipated. He's a stubborn old goat, which could mean his undoing unless I'm careful with the electroshock machine. My goal is to render Sokolov pliable, but still capable of assessing, assisting me in designing a new version of the Clockwork Soldier. At the moment, each clockwork costs a fortune, but I'm certain my old teacher and I can find a way to reduce the cost. Letter from Duke uh, Abele, uh, Kieran, my dear grand inventor, who else uh, possesses such great, such a keen mind? Could any other of my inner circle achieve such industrial marvel? I appreciate how superbly your clockwork soldiers performed in Dunwall, cutting those guards, still owed Emily Caldwin to ribbons, and Brianna Ashworth claims you've been invaluable, helping with her ocularum contraption. Delilah will be pleased. Please dispatch a courier as soon as you have what you need from Anton Sokolov. Press him as you see fit. No methods are off limit. We must find a way to produce your clockwork soldiers in greater quantity. Ramsey and the Crown Killer were just the start. I need to break down Delilah's remaining allies. Jindosh, the Duke, all of them. Oh, hi there. There's only one Kieran Jindosh. He can charge whatever he likes. Besides, you're rich enough to afford a couple of the clockworks. I happen to know you've doubled your fortune since the Duke took over the silver mines. Lower wages means higher profits. But it's my time that's precious. I'm not Play used to waiting. Neither am I. When was the last time someone had me waiting for more than an hour? Can't remember. It's almost too quick. How many clockworks did you say there were? It's a numbered set. Which is indeed 3646. <laughs> Very exclusive, whatever the count. There he goes again. Who do you suppose he's talking when to? I think about it explains the delay at least. If there is a break in, I hope the clockworks deal with it quickly. I'm tired of waiting for Chindosh. We got a letter from the Queen of Morley. So even by standards fall to your wrath, what a yes. nature's monster you are. I'll enjoy dissecting your brain and discovering the poisons within. All right, that's the assessment chamber. I don't want to go there just yet. Okay, 
the machine has detected something. This playback indicates a false. Extra diagnostic playback loop. Brianna Ashworth. So many events in motion, each exerting subtle gravity. With Delilah, a new empire could be drawn, and all the old barriers broken. Much could be accomplished. My clockwork soldiers have played their part, but each costs more coin than a wealthy man sees in a lifetime. It could take years to find a solution on my own. But if Sokolov can be tamed... All movements are linked. Everything has a purpose. It's all connected, you see. Whether I seduce my own teacher with the thrill of discovery, or whether I'm forced to apply the clap. Oh, here we go. We got an elevator right here. Meanness he needed. Ah. Uh. Level one's the assessment chamber, number one's maintenance, and then main laboratory in the office. Second person to set foot in this room, the most sophisticated laboratory in 
soldiers, dispatch this intruder. General detection state. Triggering electrostatic criminal profile. Stand clear. Switching to alternative. Ow. Be the electroshock machine Jindosh mentioned. I'm gonna do I don't have any sleep darts Ugh. general detection state the machine concludes here and nothing further is amiss Goodbye, Grand Inventor. Here's my hope that the Pale Star looked down in favor upon your attempts. Gain Sokolov's favor, but if the old goat will not bend to your will, I can offer alternatives to merely keeping him locked in your assessment chamber and subjugating him to cruel electrotherapy. Started a new effigy, cast in Sokolov's shape. Given time, I believe it might grant me some influence over your assessment guess.
Where though? Is the key to maintenance. Whalebone. Jindosh's entry on Whalebone. Quarry lost. Anton Sokolov, once the royal physician and head of the Academy of Natural Philosophy. In your prime, the most sought-after painter in all the Empire. My hero in younger days. Now, my puppet. If you're going to use this inelegant looking device against me, get on with it, Jindosh. Though I'm not sure what you hope to accomplish. I must admit to feeling a bit of professional curiosity as to the function of the apparatus. Patience, friend, patience. The sequence of events is important. You'll come to understand my Know this self, there's insufficient power to operate the electroshock machine until this is rectified. I will have to compensate bringing up more power for the electroshock machine by configuring the other laboratories form platforms so they draw the least power. This is really cool. Letter from Delilah. Kieran, you asked what the void looks and feels like. If it can be measured like a real place, here's my answer. Don't concern yourself with such matters. It is a, it is as real as anything I've experienced. But if you understood it, you know that such statements may that such a statement makes as little sense as saying that I have been dead. The void is unspeakable. It is infinite and it is nowhere. Ever changing and perpetual. There are more things in the endless black void, Karen Jindosh, than are dreamt of in your natural philosophy. Leave aside things beyond your reach and be con content that you are gifted with more insight than a common man, Delilah. Oh, there's the maintenance key. Perfect.
All right, time to go get Sokolov. Ocular order. Let's see here. A representative from the Sisters of the Ocular Order, Mr. Konos, paid a surprise visit this week to officials at the Grand Palace, delivering a message that calls into doubt the order's formerly held position on illegitimacy of our new empress, Delilah Caldwin. It seems that there is intense disagreement between the sex of the secretive organization. Well, not a full re reversal. The visit to the Grand Palace prompted the following statement from Duke Luca uh, Abelie. pleases me that the Sisters of Ocular Order have come closer to endorsing our beloved Empress Delilah Caldwin. Her recent and valiant coup is an attempt to restore just rule to the Empire. And I advise the Ocular Order and even stubborn Ab in even and the even stubborn Abbey of the Everyman to immediately embrace Delilah as Emperor Empress accepting her wisdom and authority. We thank the Ocular Sisters for delivering this vision, and we call for a day of celebration. Meanwhile, Vice Overseer Liam, Br Liam Brine, speaking on behalf of the Abbey of the Everyman, advises restraint, saying that the latest missives, missives from the Ocular Order are still being interpreted and debated. Blast resistance. I probably know what that does. Yeah, take less damage from explosions. Nothing in there. this Jindash guy even need it. There's another elevator right there.
Sokolov's needs. You know the staff, as you know, we have a special guest uh, in the assessment chamber, the infamous inventor Antal Sokolov. While the facility is not noted for his creature comforts, I expect Sokolov's basic needs and bodily functions to be taken care of so they never become a new uh, nuisance to me. Jindosh. The high and mighty Anton Sokolov won't design won't design to aid me in my efforts to make a new version of the clockwork soldier. Fine. I have another solution. My electroshock machine, long a side project, a little practical use, will be just the thing. If I can find the right calibration, I should be able to damage those parts of Sokolov's mind related to independence and free will, leaving intact his vast knowledge and hopefully an even more important quality the old man's possess uh the old man possesses uh though it pains me to admit his legendary his legendary creativity Hey, buddy. Emily Coldwin. If you're here, things have gone further than I thought. But Kieran Jendosh? Not a threat anymore. You were an interesting little girl. You've become a fascinating woman. <laughs> Let's see.
What's private? Stand clear. I'm bringing up the arc pylon. Here, buddy, you uh wait right there, okay? Oh <laughs> god, thank god for that arc pylon. Tight, buddy. Playback indicates some detection without certainty. General detection state. Okay, the machine has amplified.
machine is experiencing uncertainty. Playback for detection registered. Alright, and we're out of here. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and go to the lower district. Suglav sleeps through a lot. Well, he's also been through a lot. No, I can't uh, jump right there. Should be able to jump to here. it was possible you must have a story to tell i'll hear it back at the ship let's go then awesome mission accomplished 
All right. Uh, I killed a lot. I did. Yep. Yeah, super high chaos. Uh, missed a couple blueprints and some paintings, but that's okay. All right, guys, that's where we're going to end the video for the day. Thank you all for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure you leave it a like. And if you haven't yet, please consider subscribing. You guys can also watch me live over on Twitch. The link is in the description below. Thanks again for all the support, and I'll see you guys in the next one.